told you all that I would come back and show you how to dress a candle, okay? So, um, the first thing that you wanna do, like I said in the previous video, is to cleanse. Relax. Okay, so I'm just gonna take my Florida water. Lock. Oops. So, making a good mess. All right. And you're simply going to remove any labels and wipe your candle down. These I've already done. I think there's just one that I haven't done, but I'm just do it again real quick. These candles, um, for the most part, represent the chakras. There's one that I don't, two that I don't have, but I'm improvising. All right, you want to take that um, sticker off. Um, this one here, I'm not going to fight with that label. I'm just not tried it, failed before, so I'm just gonna leave it on. Okay. Again, this is Florida water that I'm using. You can get it from um, Amazon, uh, any stores that have. Um, like Mexican grocery stores who typically have it. Some Walmart, some Family Dollars I've heard. Of course, Amazon. It's always linked in my description uh, on Amazon. Okay. So. Okay. Like I said, I've already pretty much done this. As soon as I get my candles, I will sage them and stuff. But for the sake of this video, I just kind of want to show you what I do. Right. Clean the inner rim as well. You want to enchant or anoint, or anoint them as well. Cleansing the energy, any energy that is not yours. You want it to be removed. Okay. Label off. All right. Boom. So we got the Florida water. Uh, got them cleansed. I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit on my hands. All right. Next thing you would want to do is take some sage if you have it. Light it. Um, and as you, I have some meditation music going in the back. That just kind of sets the mood, clears the energy um, in your space. Collect your sage. Sage yourself a little bit. Center yourself. Get your energy right. Okay. Uh, like I said, I've already done this, but you basically want to sage the candles that you're going to be using. Um, I like to hold them upside down like this so that the smoke goes into the inside. Okay. If you don't have Florida water, you can use alcohol, you can use ammonia. If you have some holy water, you can use that um, as well. Okay. So these candles here are my chakra candles. Okay. Not all the right colors. I'm oop, I'm missing orange and I'm missing um, light blue, but I'm using what I have. always about your intention so if there's something you don't have try to just improvise all right so we have i wonder if i want to use um, i 
think I want to use this one instead. So let me cleanse this one. Alexa, next song. So this is a road opener candle that I just filled in to use versus the other one. So that's all. Smoke this one out. Alright, boom. So uh next thing I'm going to do is anoint my hands, I'm cleansing them with some Florida water, and I'm just gonna take Probably mix a couple of them. I'm gonna do some money drawing oil. This stuff right here. This stuff is powerful, let me tell you. Ugh, you can just feel it every time. No fails. Alright, and then I'm gonna take a little bit of the crown of success. Do the same thing. A little bit on my fingers. Anoint my hands. Say a little prayer. I'm gonna put a little bit more of this in my hand. Okay. All right. So these, I'm going to. Oh crap! My battery. So I had to change my battery. So, like I said, these are um for chakra healing. Okay. Chakra balancing. That's what these candles represent here. We have a color that mm, roughly represents each shop or some of them, you know, not right. All right, so this is a road opener candle as well as this. So one is going to be for my personal finances and this one is going to be for my business finances, okay? Or my business, period, all right? So, and then we have a white candle. Because remember I said that you should always have a white candle burning no matter what. Alright. So, the first thing I'm going to do is to take the um, money drawing oil. And I'm going to anoint the candle just by putting it around the ring. Okay. Or rim. <laughs> You can also go on the inside with it as well. Okay. Boom. Alright. Then you can take um, a chopstick and you want to stick down the sides. Let me see if I can get y'all closer. Alright, so y'all can actually see what a tea is I'm doing. Alright, better. All right, so you want to go down the sides. Um, no particular number. It's really up to you how many holes you put in the side. We've got four. Oops. It's too close. Okay. All right. All right. And um, this one here, I can't really go all the way around. But I'm just going to. Put in, yeah, just put two in that one there, okay? Chopstick is the easiest um, way to do that. Um, and then we're gonna take, I'm gonna take a couple more drops. It's a drop of money drawing oil in there. Couple of drops. I don't wanna I don't wanna waste none of this. This oil is awesome. Okay. Um, if you have some cinnamon oil, you can do um, the same thing with cinnamon oil. That's all you have, okay? All 
you definitely want to um, pray with these candles. So that's kind of what I'm doing silently. prayed okay so now what we can do um is just take some of your herbs this is some chamomile um oops this has a hole in this is some creek money herbal mix here and then we have um some cinnamon in the mix. let's see i should have some um crap let's see if i can open this nope dress your candles is really up to you the herbs that you choose to use um, totally up to you but I'm gonna take um, some cinnamon you can take uh, one of these pieces of cinnamon and put in your purse too okay because cinnamon is money drawing okay and I'm gonna try to get these pieces you know out of the way from the wick here okay um, you can push them down in the holes that we made. That's why we make the holes. It's just try to make sure that everything stays away from the wick because it can cause it to burn funny. Okay. Um, got some chamomile flowers that I'm going to put in here, which is not necessary because they're in the mix that I'm going to use. So I'm pretty much going to address both of these the same way. Um, you know, like I said, one is for money, one is for, I'm sorry, they're both for money. One is for personal finances and the other is for business, okay? So you're gonna take some chamomile flowers. And you know, the whole while you really just want to think about, imagine what it is that you want to take place, okay? You want to impart your energy into the herbs. I'm trying to stick those herbs down the, the center. Not the center, but down the hole. Okay, I'm going to take a couple of pieces of cinnamon. And this one as well. And then you want to take, um, well, I'm going to take my mix here that kind of just has a little bit of everything in it. Just got some cloves. And we're going to put it in here as well. You see that? You can take these big pieces of clove and just stick it down the hole. Booyah. And then we have, lastly, some bay leaf. Bay leaf is great for money drawing as well. You can actually just burn bay leaves if you want. You have some bay leaves, just write what it is that you want to manifest on the bay and burn it. And um, I didn't bring my cinnamon oil out here, but this money drawing oil has cinnamon oil in it. So I didn't feel it necessary, but um, you know, as the candle is burning, it smells so good. Right. Trying to get every, 
move everything away from the wig. All right, boom. Everything out of the way. Okay. So I'm trying to decide where exactly I'm going to burn these candles. So I think I'm gonna move them over here. Just so they're out of the way. Um, where do I wanna put these in my, in my um, closet or altar, but I'm just leaving them. All right, so those, oops. So those are for our chakras, okay? And then um, I'm gonna put my um, road openers here. I'm going to put the white candle in front. It serves as a way of protection to protect the energy that's surrounding my money as well as my chakras. All right, and um, I'm gonna go and grab a couple of crystals out of your vessel. This is selenite, okay? I'm gonna put it right here, and I'm gonna take my pyrite, which is also known as fool's gold, looks like that. And I'm gonna put it right here in the center. All right. And then we're gonna light these bad boys, okay? I'm gonna start with the white one. Personal row opener. Business row opener. Uh, I guess you could cut the wig if you want, but I never do. Okay, and then we're gonna light each one for the show. Root, sacral, solar plexus, root, sacral, solar plexus. Um, these aren't in, right, in the right order. Then there is your heart chakra. You have to put them in the right order. Throat chakra. No, I missed. What did I miss? What did I miss? Root, sacral, solar, heart, throat, and um, oh, third eye and crown. Okay, I got it. Booyah. All right. And they will just burn we're playing for praying for clean clear burns okay so um these will like i said they burn at different rates um these are seven day candles but that doesn't mean they're gonna burn for seven days um they may burn for three days five days whatever um but follow me on insta follow me on instagram or whatever <laughs> follow me on instagram at teacher chanel and i will keep you guys updated on these bad boys so hopefully this helped you all out hopefully y'all learned something uh, thank you all so much for watching please make sure you subscribe thumbs up the video share with a friend and i will see you in the next one